Every year, Cleveland Leadership Center's Accelerate Pitch Program brings together change makers of all ages, experience, levels, and interests. One thing they all have in common is their desire to make our community a better place. And as the 2022 finalists get ready for that big moment, our 3 News contributor Chris Webb met up with one of last year's winners whose project is already making an impact. I would say if there is like truly a need for your idea or what you want to bring forth, try to see what you can do to bring it to life. Accelerate is a pitch competition in its eighth year where Northeast Ohio residents pitch ideas to make their region stronger. Today I'm here to talk about my new initiative against light pollution, Project Delight. Cleveland Leadership Center's VP of External Affairs, Michael Bennett, speaks about Accelerate's impact. In the eight years, we've seen hundreds of individuals from across Cuyahoga County bring forth fabulous ideas that all impact people and affect them how they live and where they live. I get a real charge from seeing the presenters form and develop their ideas from when they apply in November until they hit the stage. In, in February. Many of these individuals are not used to presenting. They're just ordinary citizens who have an idea of how to change their community for the better. And one of these citizens with a community changing idea was Layla Allen, who pitched her idea in 2021. I used to work in reentry, so working with individuals that were recently incarcerated. During my time working with them as a job coach, I started to recognize that there were a lot of things that they didn't learn or that I was actually reteaching them. And I ended up jotting those down as a list which eventually became the foundation for Project COVID Box, which is just me literally placing tools and resources directly into the hands of youth. The things that we place in these boxes are in place to promote the ability to de-stress, to practice self-care, and also express your emotions. With joining the Accelerate Pitch Competition, it really did open up opportunities for people all throughout Cuyahoga County to know what Project Coping Box is all about. Through uh, participating, I've received so many different um, emails, messages, and then you have others that are like, hey, I heard about this and I want to actually donate. So what's been the impact of Project Coping Box since Accelerate? Since participating, they have still been very active. And they've also been celebrating right along with me as I've been making my own strides. We've officially become a 501c3 organization. Also, I've developed the curriculum to go right along with Project Coping Box. We need to continue to get in the practice of just generating ideas and exploring creativity to resolve, you know, real life issues. This year's winner will receive $5,000 and the remaining five finalists each receive $2,000 to help bring their ideas to life. And Chris, we know you have gone through this program yourself. Why do you think the opportunity is so important that it's out there? Well, I pitched a project in 2015 called If These Walls Could Talk. It was a historical documentary. And when you strip away the competition aspect and the potential prize money, what it boils down to for me is this. Accelerate was one of the first times that I stood and spoke about an idea that I thought could impact our city. I think that that's something that everybody should do if they have an idea that they think could make waves in Cleveland. Chris, thanks very much for being with us and a great story tonight. Thank you. This year's finalist competition will be held on February 24th. It will be hosted by our own Mike Polk Jr. We have more information on how to get tickets on our website at WKYC.com.